Hello and welcome back to the Science and Engineering Practices Teacher, Teacher Toolkit. This toolkit, which will focus on Science and Engineering Practice 4, is a reference guide for teachers in developing college and career ready students. Remember the goals of these toolkits are to help you identify areas in your current practices that correlate to science and engineering and to help you create and or modify assessments to address these practices. Science and Engineering Practice 4, Analyzing and Interpreting Results is essential to developing proficiency skills in one student alongside the seven other practices. Scientists and engineers use a wide range of tools to analyze data. Scientists analyze and interpret data in order to identify patterns and determine the credibility of the, their experimental design. Engineers analyze and interpret data to determine how well various proposed solutions meet specific design criteria. Students at cross grade levels are able to record observations, predict outcomes, and analyze data to some extent. This skill progresses as one learns new skills of documenting and manipulating data sets. Science and Engineering Practice 4, Analyzing and Interpreting Data, include tasks in which students must draw conclusions from data presented or be able to interpret graphs, tables, or diagrams. This NAEP design and investigation to find the volume of a container grade 4 item was aligned by Montana teachers to be in best agreement with the K-12 science framework grades K-2 grade band and a depth of knowledge level 3. The student needs to distinguish between what information is relevant to answering this question and may be best used as an idea for demonstration purposes at this grade level. This NAEP decide how to make a closed electrical circuit grade 4 item was aligned by Montana teachers within the same grade band of the K-12 science framework and at a similar difficulty level. Although the data is not in a format that is typically thought of as a way to present data like graphs, tables, or charts, the student must still interpret and analyze the diagram in order to reach a conclusion as to why the light bulb did not light up. This NAEP grade 12, Draw Conclusions About Photosynthesis Based on Observations, was aligned by Montana teachers to be in best agreement with the Science K-12 Framework 6-8 grade band. By grades 6-8, through eight, students begin to be able to connect more complex processes, and their level of analyzing and interpreting data also increases. The depth of knowledge needed to answer this question successfully is at a depth of knowledge level 3. While younger grades develop an understanding of what makes up the universe, in grades 9 through 12, students develop a deeper understanding of how these concepts are known and upon what these understandings are based. Emission spectra data presented in this question, as well as the abbreviations of four elements, must be analyzed and interpreted in order to successfully answer this question. Montana teachers found, the, found this example, the NAEP Analyze Emission Spectra to Determine Elements Present in a Star, Grade 12 item, to be best aligned to the 9-12 through 12 grade band of the Science K-12 through 12 framework and at a depth of knowledge level 2. A tale of four cities using data to model variations in regional climate in the western United States found on the Next Generation Science Standards main page under the Implementation tab Resources link in the Classroom Sample Task PDF provides enough detailed information to implement lessons in which students analyze and interpret data across grade levels. If you haven't checked out the example lesson link up to this point, I highly recommend you take a quick look at this one. Complexity can be simplified if given the tools. Thank you for exploring practices one through four with me and for your concerted effort to incorporate these research-based practices from the framework into your instruction. These ideas highlight the power of integrating the understanding of the ideas of science with the engagement into the practices of science. So I look forward to exploring and unwrapping science and engineering practice five using mathematics and conceptual thinking with you by looking at the grade level expectations, the aligned NAEP exemplar items, 
and the Next Generation Science Standards classroom activities to ease your transition to college and career-ready students.